All right. Well, if you don't know who I am, I am Diamond Senior Gold Ambassador Emily Roberts. And tonight you are going to hear, it's back to our normal schedule. So 10, 10, 10. So 10 minutes of a testimony. This is somebody that is really special to me. We just got back from gold school together and she's been on our team for a little while. So she's not a new ambassador, but she is a new senior gold ranked up ambassador. And she's going to share a little bit about how that came to be. Um, you hear us shout her out in the team page and on these calls. And then um, we do have another guest tonight from corporate. His name is Serge Guren. Serge and I had the pleasure of working together and helping. Um, yes, Serge, I'll unmute you in just a second. <laughs> We got to work together on the holiday line, and um, you're going to hear from him as well. Um, Serge, are you on a time crunch? Do you need to go first? No? Okay, cool. I'm going to let Sydney go first then. So, Sydney, you are going to kick us off. I'll, I'm going to unmute you in just a second. But some things to know about Sydney. This mama is tenacious, you guys. She is tenacious. Um, She's also in the corporate America world. So a lot of you are stay-at-home moms, college students, some of you are grandparents. Um, all of us are in very different seasons of life, but I feel like you're going to find bits and pieces of Sydney's story that you relate to because she is in the best of both worlds. So Sydney, go ahead and um, take it over. Let me unmute you real quick. Hey, um, I'm Sydney. Thanks for having me. I'm just going to jump right in because I know we're on a time crunch here. I've got a few things to share about. Um, I've been with Plexus for over five years and I started with Triplex like most do. It helped me personally with weight loss paired with, you know, moving my body, eating right. But number one for me personally was it helped me with my anxiety. I had debilitating anxiety to the point where I would have to pull over call 911 sometimes, ambulance would come, I'd keep a paper bag in my purse, in my car, in my desk drawer at all times, because that's what they give you when you go to the hospital and you're having a panic attack, so you can control your breathing. Um, I haven't had to use a paper bag in about five years, um, so that is my personal testimony along with weight loss, but what I'm really here to share with you guys about is my son's testimony. So like Emily said, I've been with Plexus for a long time. I'm not new, but, you know, whenever gut health is something that becomes a part of your daily routine, you don't realize the impact it actually has because you start feeling better and that becomes your normal way of life. So my son had a array of unexplained symptoms that started happening in May of this year. He collapsed at school. Um... And so that was in May and, um, I missed the phone call, three phone calls from the nurse, the principal, the teacher, um, because I was at work and we couldn't find out what the issue was. We had gone to doctors, done testing, done all the things. Well, after all that, and they still couldn't tell me what was wrong with him. He got better. We cut out gluten. We just watched his diet some more. We just really, really watched him and made some changes at home. He's been on the kids' vitamins, but that's kind of where I left it. I didn't think to look any further into it other than diet. Well, symptoms progressed. A few months later on, he had something that he was diagnosed with called HSP autoimmune disease. And it is a, it's an acronym for some guy's name that, you know, came up with the name a long time ago. It's very rare. Our pediatrician has been in practice for over 30 years and family medicine has done deliveries, ped pediatrics, all the things. And he has only ever seen two cases in his entire career, my son being one of them. It causes um, inflammation of your muscles, your, um, your, your, your blood vessels, to the point where it can disable you and it also causes inflammation of the intestinal wall so what this means is for my six-year-old little boy we live out here in the country who hops hay bales rides his bike helps daddy feed cows it means that 
one day when he got into the bathtub, he had bruising all down his lower extremities. He goes to school and childcare. So as a mama, first thought was what is happening? It progressed from that to his back swelling to the point where it looked like his belly and he was wheelchair bound. Perfectly healthy boy, this happens. We go to the emergency room, blood test after x-ray, after all the tests, they cannot give me a solution. So I decided to put him on triplex. He has been on triplex, I guess, since July when things started getting very, very serious. Um, ever since he takes half of a capsule of BioCleanse, half of a capsule of ProBio5, and he drinks about half a slim every two to three days. We have had zero issue. He has had uh, zero relapse, which is very common with this autoimmune disease. And he's my healthy little boy again. So I'm a lifer with Plexus, and I believe Triplex is literally for everyone. Even my four-year-old and 18-month-old take ProBio5. Um, so that is my product testimony. I could keep going about it, but Emily and I also talked about um, me talking about the business just for a hot minute. I started Plexus and I was all in. I went fast start silver. I ended up going senior silver. And then I was like, eh, I ain't got time for this, right? So I was having my second kid. I didn't need all that. I was feeling good. Why well, work the business? I have a great job. What's the point? I don't have time, right? Well, after everything happened with my oldest son earlier this year, I decided I I need to make time because I need more time with my children. I need to be able to say yes more to trips and baseball and Halloween costumes and all the things that I want to say yes to. So I decided to jump back in. Since July, I have gone from re-ranking silver because I didn't even have 10 points in June. I mean, there was like nothing. It was me and my mom and my husband. I would get some for him every once in a while under his account. Um, and I have ranked up to gold in July, I think. And then senior gold, August and September. I earned the cruise with the 1,250 points for me and my husband, which by the way, we have never traveled. We have never been on an airplane. So this is a huge opportunity for us. And I've already earned Punta Cana. So I'm not saying all of this to brag. I am saying this to build belief and build hope and just spread the word that there are people out there that want to help you in your business and in your health and not just you, but your children and your family. And I could keep talking, but I'm probably at my 10 minutes and, um, I just want everybody, if you get anything from this, to know that God is going to provide. Somebody asked me to join Plexus nine years ago. I said no for four years. If somebody wouldn't have brought that up nine years ago, who knows if anybody else would have asked me. So that's me. That's my story. Sydney, I'm so proud of you. And it just kind of goes to show that you might hear the word no a lot. I feel like we need to kind of create normalcy around hearing the word no this is sales at the end of the day you're in sales you're going to have a lot of conversations and what I love about Sydney is that she said no she was all in in her corporate America world until everything stopped and she missed a huge moment in her son's health shift and she was like I have something that's going to help him she used mother's intuition and was like, this is what helps me with this, this, and this. I think it's going to help him too. And I love that he's doing so much better. And what's crazy about Sydney's story is like, like she said, like she didn't know this was going to happen nine years later. Like she's been on Plexus. She was happy. She has a great job. Uh, she's a, what are you, an escrow officer? Um, she works very, very hard. And not only that, but Sydney's belief in Plexus and opportunity also trickled onto her mom, Paula, who's 60 and just went gold. So 
it is just really, really, really special to see this ripple effect happening in her small town because she lives in a small town. And so I just think that's so great. So Sydney, thank you so much for sharing. Um, you guys, I hope that just encourages you that she went from zero to 100. Like that's what it feels like, right? She earned that cruise. She's going on a vacation with her husband for the first time ever in their marriage. Like sometimes we think that you just, you know, if you don't have this amazing before and after photo, and if you're not an emerald that you're not successful at this, and that's not the case. Success comes in so many different shapes and sizes and you, whatever surprises you about yourself, it's usually something that you're successful at. That is what I've learned is that like, look at me pouring my creative outlet into this, or look at me making a, a paycheck that I used to make annually in corporate America. It's what I make monthly in, in Plexus. And it's just like, it kind of blows my mind sometimes because you're always chasing that next thing, right? Chasing that next carrot. But sometimes you need to stop and have some gratitude of like, look how far we've come. Look what we're doing. And so Sydney, you're a great example of that. Um, You guys, let's, let's segue that amazing product system that she highlighted, Triplex. Um, nobody really knows what it means when you say that. So when we say our gut health system, people are like, oh yeah, the pink drink, ProBio5, BioCleanse. That's our superpower. That is our flex in the network marketing industry. And I absolutely love those three products. I've used them myself since 2014. And um, tonight we have the pleasure of getting to hear straight from somebody that is behind the scenes at corporate working in marketing. He was, he's been around for eight years, but the crazy thing about it is like with holiday and joy home and like little nuggets and things that you see, he's like the brains behind it. And so we have become really good friends in the last month because we launched um, the beautiful holiday line that Michael and Serge and the team had developed for us. Snickerdoodle protein. Serge already knows I bought like 10 bags. Like it's on every subscription. I'm here for it. I, I love this holiday line. So for those of you that like to nerd out on products and you're like, tell me the things, tell me, why do I need this? Why do I want to do that? Serge, that is his specialty. I mean, yeah, they make things look really pretty and they're packaged great and they make things marketable for us, but he's so stinking smart. So Serge, I'm going to unmute you and I'm going to let you share your bit. And I can't wait for you guys to get to know him. I do not know if I can live up to that, but thank you. I would just like to say a shout out to Emily, who has been the best friend and advisor through this process of me taking over product marketing. And we had a we have we are having a lot of fun. We're not done yet. We're still selling holiday right now. So sorry, I'm shaking my computer. I wanted to go through and Sydney, that story was so amazing. And also I think a really good segue into just how important the gut microbiome is to real to building amazing health. So I wanted to talk about while triplex definitely are our hero and our core, I I am in love with three other products and I'm going to talk through because I think it's, it's good to think about when you're talking to a customer who like, if that's not their thing, we have products that work for everyone. And I'm going to take you my three favorite products. I'm going to live in one for probably the longest. So I'm going to end there. First favorite product. And I know that Emily and I share our love for this Plexus Greens. I love this product. I eat a lot of fruits and vegetables, but really you can never get enough fruits and veggies. What I love about Plexus Greens, first up, we've got all these fermented fruits and veggies. Why do we love that? Other than getting you know all the antioxidants there, fermented fruits and vegetables, they're easier to digest. And a lot of people have trouble, the more fiber and the more greens you get, the harder it can get to digest. You ferment it, it makes it easier. It also helps with gut health at that point. When you're fermenting something, you're ending up with probiotics, you're ending up with the vegetables and the fruits, they're prebiotic, so great for your gut. Also to make, because this product does have a good amount of fiber, ginger, really good for digestion. It has been used for thousands of years, originally in Chinese medicine, Ayurveda, and then it's just been handed down to us. Um, I don't know if anyone else loves kombucha. The kombucha powder is in here. I just happen to like the taste of it. I can say there are definitely, um, prebiotic benefits to it, probiotic benefits, because it's also fermented. So whenever you're you're um, fermenting something like a yogurt, what you're using is a bacteria to create that process. So that is the probiotic that is then used 
to increase gut health. Oat fiber, oatmeal is one of the healthiest things out there. It is both prebiotic and it has some probiotic benefits too as well. Then we've got all the leafy greens, kale, spinach, broccoli. I, I want to love broccoli. I really want to love it. I don't like broccoli. I, I just can't. So I do like spinach, but I love that this product, like I love fruit. I have a hard time eating greens all the time. This is such an easy way to get it into your diet and it's so healthy. My next thing, so I paired like, I've got my own triplex going on here. Vital Biome, I love this product. I don't know who's, oh, I see people nodding. Vital Biome is amazing. It's got, why? So psychobiotics. Psychobiotics are probiotics that have been clinically studied to confer mental health benefits. So with this, there's three strains and I'm, I'm going to go into the Latin and just not along because Lactobacillus helveticus, that's a probiotic strain that has been studied to reduce, um, look at that. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Um, stress and anxiety. It, um, we've got Bifidobacterium longum. That is also something that's used to improve mood and increase feelings of relaxation. Aside from, uh, no one wants to feel stressed. I don't know about y'all, but I work long hours. I also work from home. I love it. But the thing is, when you're working from home, you never know when to stop working. So I'm working. It is, it's nine o'clock at night here. This is one of the best things I could be doing at nine though. I love Emily. I'd do anything for her. So what I love about this, so when you think about healthy gut, healthy weight, psychobiotics, what they're doing, so they're helping us reduce stress, which also means we're going to have less cortisol in our system. Cortisol directly affects our ability to maintain a healthy weight. Also, the more stressed out you are, the more it starts to affect our gut microbiome. Increased stress, increased level of anxiety, that's going to mean that the beneficial bacteria are going to decrease in the gut and the harmful ones are going to increase. This is also, Vital Biome also has two probiotics in it that not for mental health, for gut health. So I love this. You're getting, you're chill, you're relaxed, and you're also getting the gut benefits. And then my favorite product, which is great for the season and that I feel like is really, we're just not paying attention to it, Immune Plus. Emily, I know you didn't have a good time with this, but I'm going to speak to it from, and there's reasons. I want to walk through like what Immune Plus is and who might not take it. Why, why you might look at a customer and say, not for you, like Sydney autoimmune diseases. I'll get into a little bit why, but there's customers it's going to work for and people that it won't. Also, let's pretend that across the screen, I've got an FDA disclaimer so that compliance does not yell at me. So um, Immune Plus, we've got two mushroom things within it. Um, there's agaricus and there's turkey tail. Both of these have been clinically studied to increase uh, T helper cells and CD4 cells. Mm -hmm. So that's really good if you're having, uh, if you're low in immunity to kick those up a notch. Then we've got andrographis. That is, it's popularly known as Indian echinacea. It's an Indian herb in Ayurveda. What it's been studied for, it's been studied for a lot of things, but it caught a lot of attention in the past five years because it's been shown in studies to reduce the severity of cold and flus. Especially anything with respiratory things, that's been shown to be helpful. And then it's got black rice, which is just, it's a really good antioxidant, been shown to reduce inflammation. All the products here that I'm talking about, they got a lot of anti-inflammatories. Immune Plus, someone who doesn't want to take this. If you have got someone who's got an autoimmune disease, that's definitely a no. So autoimmune diseases, just in Sydney, I know you know this, but what's happening is the body, the cells in the body are attacking themselves. Why you don't want to recommend this is that person's immune system is overstimulated. Giving them something like an Immune Plus, that can cause their immune system to kick into overdrive. So you don't want that. So I think be, this might be a product I love, but I know that Emily and I have talked about this. It's one to be cautious about. And really, if you're going to sell it, talk to your customers. Do you have anything? Do you have any chronic illnesses? Is there anything you've got going on with your immune system? Talk that through so that you can provide them with the best thing. Vital Biome, that works for everyone. There is no one, I think, alive today who cannot benefit from Vital Biome. We are all stressed out. We are all like... This, like, pair that with sleep. If you're having trouble sleeping, I love that. Greens, almost none of us get enough greens. 
so that that's my my product overview. I love like all the stories that y'all are sharing about what it's done. Sleep and Vital Biome, yes, shout out to that. Everything that you know, hearing Sydney your story about your son, that's so powerful to hear that we have amazing products. Our products are incredible. They are the best on the market. They are they have so much science behind them. Even if compliance won't always let me say all the science that's behind them. These are products that can change people's lives. So I love the fact that we can do something that we can get out there and share with our customers. This is a product that's really going to change you. And to know that at Plexus, like everyone here is about how can we create something that's going to change your lives? So that is my speech. Em, did I keep it to 10 minutes? Perfect. Thanks so much. Perfect. And it's a great segue of sharing with your customers about the products that we have, because we're going to talk about turning your nose not necessarily into yeses, but maybes. So capturing your audience's attention, the conversations you're having, right? You're using social media, you're sharing with a friend, you're sharing with your kid's teacher, you're talking to somebody at the gym, your neighbor, and you just, they seen your transformation. They see the glow, right? Like a lot of you have seen Scott's before and after picture over the last six months. And you're like, dude, dang, <laughs> like the how did he get like that? And I'm like, uh, we don't know. It just kind of happened. But like, look at him now. And it's like, there's a significant like sparkle in people's eyes when they use our products. And you'll know what I'm talking about. We call it a glow up. Um, and I just, I don't know. I don't know why people just don't say yes, because we believe in Plexus, right? And we're so excited and we want to tell everyone and help them begin and then they just like to sit on that uncomfortable fence. They like to sit there and they like to say, no, I was that person. I said, no, y'all know, y'all know my story at least 15 months. Like if I look at a calendar, I know for sure I told her no for 15 months and I watched. And while I watched a friend of um, our families, I watched her earn a, a Plexus Lexus while I said no. And I didn't even talk to her about Plexus. I was talking to someone else about Plexus, but I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. How'd she do that? And so that was my moment. I was in, I'd like, like Sydney, I was in a different season of life. When I was first introduced to Plexus, I was not a mom. I had a great big girl corporate American job. I was making great money. And here 15 months later, I was a mom. I was on maternity leave. My husband was in the Middle East on deployment. And I was a 16 hour full-time college student. And I was not living life. Um, I had lots of things going on with my health. And so when Plexus was introduced to me, it was literally, I'm not even kidding. I told, I, I, you have heard this story a million times. I was like, uh, that's for old people. Gut health is for old people. I'm 24. That's at the time I was 24. I knew everything. And I was like, I'm not taking a probiotic. I'm not drinking my little prune juice. What do I look like a 67 year old? Like I was such a brat because I thought I knew it all. Meanwhile, the local burger joint was greeting me by on a first name basis because I showed up every day to get a 32 ounce diet soda for energy to get through the day with my nursing baby who was cluster feeding and college online courses. I was a hot mess. Okay. So thankfully, thankfully we have learned in the sales world, people need to be exposed to gut health or plexus or whatever it is that you are trying, whatever problem you're trying to solve for them through plexus. They need eight to 12 exposures, right? That's what statistics tell us. So how, what magic word, what magic phrase can I go back to that conversation with, right? Maybe you've been adding value. You've shared a testimony like Sydney's story. Maybe you've introduced add-on products like Greens or Immune Plus, or you've talked about our probiotic. You've talked about Active or Edge or whatever product that you're loving You've shared those things with them and they're just like, eh. right. They're not even saying no. It's like, is it a maybe like I keep coming back. I keep giving you information. You haven't, you know, given me the middle finger of messenger. So I'm just going to keep talking and we love that. So here are, um, we're going back to this book, exactly what to say. It's by Phil M. Jones. Um, you can follow him on Instagram. He was our guest speaker in Mexico and we did a Plexus book club with him. Uh, by the way, Plexus book club is every month. Um, you don't have to read the book, by the way. You can always read the book after the fact. But the but Plexus spends money pouring into us to get these huge authors of bestsellers to talk about the book and how you can apply it in your Plexus business. So 
you know, there's people in other companies, there's people that want to do network marketing and that would be a selling point for them, like book club. So maybe that, that's not your magic. I'm not, I'm going to give you a magic phrase in a second, but that's something you could take back into the conversation is, oh, Hey, on Saturday, I'm doing a book club. Do you want to, you want to get on the zoom with me? It's on zoom. It's 30 minutes. Super great. Right? Like I'm a, I, I have a Kindle. I'm a book nerd. I love all the things, but you guys, I tell you what, Plexus Book Club could be a great way to segue those conversations. You've been getting all those no's. Well, that might be the thing for you, but I'm going to give you some magic words. So Phil M. Jones uses different phrases and introductions to conversations to get people to start thinking the way he wants them to think. He uses these phrases because these phrases speak to the sub conscious. So here are your magic phrases. If you're writing notes, which some of you are, I want you to write this down. Before you make up your mind, that's the phrase. Before you make up your mind. How many of you have said that before? I'm thinking of conversations I've had with friends or like you're planning a trip or a party or you're going out to dinner. Anybody married and your husband asks you what you want for dinner and you're like, yeah, I don't know. But you do know, you know where you don't want to go. <laughs> you don't know what you're hungry for, but you know where you don't want to go. And he's like, all right, well, do you want to go here? And you're like, no. And he's like, you just said you don't care where we go. And you're like, yeah, but I don't want to go there right? So before you make up your mind is a great, inner, it's a great way to get them off the no fence into the maybe zone and eventually to a yes, because this removes friction. These words remove, remove friction. Moving somebody from a no to a yes is nearly impossible. Before you can move someone to full on agreement, your first action is to move them into the position of maybe. So using the words before you make up your mind, is going to allow them some time to think and be like, oh, she's not rushing me. Oh, he doesn't need an answer right this second. Okay, well now I'm actually considering what it is you are going to offer up. So here are some examples. Sydney, look, before you make up your mind, let's make sure you've looked at all the facts. And so now um, this you know, provides clarity. I love this book and I love what he talks about because he says, sometimes we ask confusing questions. Sometimes we don't listen long enough and we just start answering them before they can even process all the things that we're asking of them. Like, well, how long have you been feeling that way? Like we turn into Dr. Phil and they're like, listen, I just want a pink drink. They're not here to go to therapy sometimes, right? They just want what you're having because you look happy in all your Facebook pictures. Okay. So um, this is another example. Before you make up your mind, why don't we just run through the details one more time so you can know what it is you're saying no to. I love this phrase. This is actually a phrase that I use often. Um, at Gold School, I stood up and I shared an example of a message I shared with one of my dream teamers. So this is a girl that I've known for about five to six years. Um, she intimidated the crap out of me at the gym. She was like super buff. And I was like, I'm going to be like you when I grow up. And I just, I, we, we were Facebook friends. We saw each other at the gym, but like, I just didn't have the courage to bring up Plexus because I have friends in the fitness world that look buff and jacked, but they have terrible, terrible gut health, terrible digestive issues. And so, um, yay, this book's on sale. Sarah said it's nine 50 on Amazon. Um, and so this girl, I sent her this message and I don't have it in front of me, but I used now, listen, before you tell me, no, I need you to know what you're saying. No, to. And I explained to her, I'm like, this is, I, I used another magic word of his, which is imagine. It's one of my favorite words because it's vision casting. You're not just saying you're going to, you know, one and done, like order and go away. Like imagine yourself 90 days from now, you've been taking your plexus for 90 days. You're feeling great. You have now a before and after photo you can share with the world. People are starting to see a difference in you, right? I like to say those types of phrases, imagine before you make up your mind, this gets people out of the no way zone into considering, you know what? She is trying to make sure that everything is crystal clear, that I do know what I'm ordering, that I do know I have a subscription, that I do know um, what gut health actually is and like what I'm working towards, that I'm not going to look like Carrie Underwood in two weeks, right? I think a lot of people have like these crazy expectations, but when we use magic words like this in our conversations, it builds trust, right? 
Okay. You have the power in these situations to remove the barrier by responding with a powerful question that eliminates the other person's argument. I like um, this, I guess it's an example. I'm going to read it to you because I think it's great for Plexus and then we're going to wrap this thing up. And I want you to tell me what magic words you hear as I read this because he uses a bunch of them. Imagine that you want a friend to join you for the night out next Friday. Your friend says the reason they cannot join you is because the car is in repair and the buses do not run that late. You could eliminate this challenge with the question. If I could pick you up and drop you off at home, then will you be able to be ready at 7 p.m.? The same principle can be used when someone is looking for you to reduce your price with a competitive offer or discount, right? How many of you follow up with someone? They're like, well, is there a discount this month? What are the specials? What are the sales? And it's like, listen, don't cheapen my gut health. It's changed my life, okay? Like you get all gangster on them and they're like, I just I just want a coupon. Um, so it's the same principle. If I can match that price for you, then would you be happy to place that order with me today? How many of your people say they found, they use, you know, an Amazon vitamin or a Walmart vitamin or a GNC vitamin, or they use something else? I like to use, you know, before you make up your mind, would you consider making some healthy swaps of things currently in your pantry with what I'm suggesting? And by agreeing to this, I'll give you a $10 off coupon. What if we went into the conversation that way versus Sydney, the stuff you're using sucks and it's $10 off right now. You need to order. See how like one of them like puts them on the defense. Like, what do you mean? My stuff sucks. Like now I'm never going to use yours versus. So listen, what if we, you know, did the whole switcheroo and I give you a discount, right? Yes. Look at all the magic words y'all saw. Okay. In both of these scenarios, you are still not obligated to meet the condition presented, but you are in control of what happens next. You may receive further reasons and honesty from the other person that prevents you from moving forward, or you may find that you gain their agreement. With their agreement to the condition, you can now present your best option to them and will be far more likely to reach your desired outcome. So another great way to do this, and if you think about it, Plexus does this too. When you go to our website to make a purchase with Plexus, are there not, I mean, I know right now it's a little different, but are there not three ways to work this whole thing or to make a Plexus purchase? Retail, VIP customer, brand ambassador. We know which one's the best because we're already in. The person that's trying to make the decision that is telling themselves no and talking themselves out of it, um, you want to make them feel like they've made the best decision ever. And so you want to get them to brand ambassador. You want to get them believing in the product and believing in themselves just as much. And so that's why using these phrases and words to talk in the future, imagine 90 days from now, imagine yourself with me in Punta Cana when we help you help 25 people get started or, you know, Hey, before you make up your mind, I want you to know that blank. So I just, I don't know. I love this book. Please promise me you'll go grab it 10 bucks and you can really, really, really learn exactly what to say in your business because some of you are doing the reach outs. You're doing the reach outs. You're talking to people every single day and you're getting nose, 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 nose like crazy. And so when you do get that, yes, it's probably because you just switched your verbiage around just a little bit. So Thank you guys for getting on tonight. I hope that you immediately apply what you have heard and learned today. I know I'm going to be adding Vital Biome to my subscription. I already have greens. Greens is my favorite thing. I drink it before dinner every single night. Um, sometimes I mix it with my Slim. And if you've never had our greens, I put it in the chat and I don't know if y'all saw it, but our greens taste good. Okay. They taste good. I've had so many greens literally like die on the back shelf of my pantry over time because they taste like dirt. They literally taste like soil from Home Depot. And here's the thing. Nobody wants to drink soil from Home Depot, but Plexus greens. I know this is why Chris Reed and I don't do compliance videos, Serge. <laughs> so Plexus greens taste like I don't know. I get like apple-y pear vibes and they, there's a little grit. There's some texture in it. And that's that fermented greens and veggies that he was talking about, that kombucha. Um, so what I do, and I'm just throwing it back to my college days, we take it like a shot. All right. I, I just do, I mix my pink drink. I put my greens in a shaker cup with like maybe four ounces of water. 
and we throw it back and it's sweet and it's good. And it does not taste like soil from Home Depot. So you are welcome for that lovely analogy. Uh, as for Vital Biome, that is probably the number one product I give credit to in my husband's transformation in the last six months. He went from, um, you know, day drinking, middle day, like night drinking and just not being himself, um, not being happy, sleeping all weekend long. And I could not figure out how to help him. And he was just chronically stressed. You could see, like, I call it the silent selfie killer when you're like in all your before photos, but you're not, it's not weight. You're just puffy. And now he's got his glow back. I mean, I don't know if guys want to be told they had a glow up, but my man's had a glow up. And that's the number one I think the number one product I can attribute to his change. The second one would be Plexus Active. Um, he was drinking three to six cups of coffee every single day, obviously having trouble sleeping at night with all that caffeine in his, in his veins. Um, and then it was, you know, his adrenal fatigue was through the roof. I think his cortisol shot up every time he would start and end his day with coffee. So he was just in like flight or fight mode all last year. And that in return, I mean, he was puffy and irritable and so moody. And so in March of 2023, uh, we put Scott on Vital Biome and Slim Hunger Control Black Cherry Lime, Active Star Fruit Guava. And then if I can sneak it in there, because now he knows the difference between Vital Biome and Metaburn because the, the capsules look different. If I can sneak it in there, I'll put him on Metaburn too. Because when that man takes the Metaburn, my whole garage is organized. I love that product too. And that's a surge. We're gonna have to have you back to talk about Metaburn because all of us, well, the majority of us love, love that product. But anyways, thank you guys for getting on. Everyone say thanks to Surge. Um, you will probably see him more and more, hopefully at convention in Vegas next year, or maybe Super Saturday. Um, Super Saturday registration is open. You can go online, go to the Plexus Go app and register. If you want to go in person, it's going to be uh, near home office in Arizona. I'm going to go in person in Arizona. If not, I understand it's the beginning of the year, so you can watch it virtually this year. And there's an option for both ways. Going in person is way more fun. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. I know it's expensive and you got to jump on a flight or a road trip, but it's so fun. You can sleep on somebody's floor of their hotel room. It'll be worth it. Um, and then uh, convention registration is open for Vegas next year. And Vegas is just, it's, it's so fun. I mean, I know Vegas is dirty Vegas, but like with Plexus, it's so fun. And, and it's so much cheaper than other conventions because it's Vegas and people just buddy up, get a group of four of you, Go split an $89 hotel at Excalibur and then walk over to convention every day. It'll be great. Uh, it's my favorite, favorite, favorite time of year. I love it because I get to see you guys in person. I get to hug y'all and squeeze y'all. Sydney's been on our team for a gazillion years, and I finally got to hug her this weekend at Gold School. Isn't that crazy? It was like, oh, there, there were probably some tears. There's like at least two, two tears. Some moments, Sydney's like, I don't cry. What are you talking about? But it was so, so great. And for those of you working on gold and senior gold, you can go to the next gold school. As soon as we have the, the destination and all that, we will get you there. It is so, so special. And they gave y'all swag and like a selfie ring light. And there was corporate executives there that you get to take pictures with and talk to and ask hard questions to. And so it was really, really cool. Go check out Sydney and Lauren's Facebooks for pictures of gold school. Uh, it was really, really cool. They got to meet uh, Celeste Gwynn, our top earner in Plexus, and one of my uplines. They also got to meet our CEO, Jean Tip. So like, it was a really cool, like jam-packed day. And you can, you can earn it too. Let's get you to gold. Thanks for being on, you guys. And I'll see y'all next week. Have a great night. Bye, everybody.